what up YouTube we're about to change the differential on the e350 here I'm gonna show you how to do it all right here we go okay so it's cool because these vans are tall so I didn't even have to jack it up but I'm gonna take this out I'm gonna put this in here siphon all that out of there right into this milk can and then once it's done siphoning it out, then we're gonna fill it back up quick. All right, okay. Put the socket in. Try to get it started. Like that. Get it started. Let's see if the impact. There we go, all right. trying to make a mess okay nothing came out okay Get that started, if you can get it going. It's not the easiest thing to do. Okay, it's going. So now we're just gonna let that fill this up, get all this out of there. It just takes time. As you can see, it's starting to siphon itself out. And you can see right here on the tube, still got fluid in it so it's just slowly pulling that thick fluid out of there by siphoning it all right we'll come back when it's empty all right all right to get the last little bits out air, com air compressor Okay, that's how much we got out. Pretty much like three fourths of a gallon. So now we're gonna measure up this much and we're gonna put it back in there. All right, let's go measure it up. I'm gonna pour the oil inside this old oil can and it has measurements right here on the side, whatever it goes to. We're gonna fill up this sprayer that you get from um, like Home Depot for 10 bucks with the oil and the additive, we're gonna pump it up, we're gonna spray it right into the differential. All right, let's measure it out. Okay, if you look right here, we're at three liters. Let's put three liters in here. Okay, we need three liters. I'm gonna do some oil stabilizer. Halfway up. And we're going to do some gear oil. Okay. Just one liter. Remember, we got to make three of them. Okay. Once we got it, we'll just pour it in here.
And then we'll do one more of the Lucas halfway. That means we'll have one liter of Lucas added to the two liters of gear oil. A one third ratio. And then one more of just gear oil. Do a little bit more in there. Just so we have some extra in here if we need it. Okay, got some thick stuff in there. Now we're going to stick this, the pump, make sure it's clean. Okay, we're on. Now let's go fill it up. Okay, we have our jug of oil. Let's put some pressure into it. Pump it up here. All right, it's pretty good. And we're gonna take our hose. Stick it right in the hole. And then we're just gonna pull this trigger. There she goes. We're just gonna have to have enough pressure in the system, but we're just gonna fill it up just like that. Right? Just like this. See it flowing through there? Push the button. Stop the button. All right, I'm gonna fill it up. Come back when it's done. Here's the drain plug that came out. If you look, there's a magnet right there at the tip of it. And then I rubbed it right here. And you can see all the pieces of metal that were on that. That's protecting the differential from getting all that metal up in there in the gears. So whenever you do this, wipe all the tip of that thing right off. Clean it good, you know. Okay, we're almost a little bit left in there, but it's almost done. It's almost filled back up. It's still going. Once it's done, put the drain plug back in. Okay, I've got it filled up. Put this drain plug back in. Tighten it down. Nice and tight. Take this magnet and put it right next to that other magnet. Just in case anything comes off the magnet in there, it'll stick up into here. All right. That's how you change your. That's how you change your differential. That's how you change your differential.